Hi everyone, you're with Sonia from Angel Light Healing. Thank you for joining me today. Uh, it's Wednesday the 15th of August. Wow, we're halfway through the month already. Okay, well as you can see I've been busy shuffling some angel cards um, and I've shuffled four card decks uh, today. So as you can see there's a lot to get through. If you are after your own personal reading, um, get in contact with me, Angel Light Healing, L-Y-T-E at outlook.com if you're after your own personal reading. Uh, the special offer is until the 31st of August at $20. These are email readings, so um, I can email anyone, anytime, anywhere. So that's um, the beauty about these readings. Um, but a lot of you ask me what cards do I use, so I'm gonna quickly show you. The Magical Unicorns Oracle cards are the top two cards. Then these purple ones here, these gorgeous cards, are the magical messages from the fairies. The one in the middle, this one here, is angel answers. How beautiful are these cards? And then the last one, these three cards here, are the Archangel Power Tarot cards. So all these card decks are by Doreen Virtue. Some of you may have heard of her, some perhaps you haven't, which is fine. So just in regards to this reading today, it is a general reading. Um, I'm not focusing on any particular area. However, I do pray that for those of you who are watching that um, you do receive a message or two or this whole reading um, does relate to you. So I do welcome feedback. Um, I am on Facebook and on YouTube as well. So let's get started. First card that comes through is Happy Thoughts. To feel happier right now, think about a memory or something else that makes you smile. Okay, so have you been feeling a little down lately? Have your emotions been a little up and down, perhaps, just like the waves of the ocean? As you can see, the unicorn in this card is sitting at the top of the steps, overlooking the beautiful castle in the background. There's a lot of clouds though, so this represents your thoughts being clouded, your judgment being clouded, perhaps. Perhaps you're not getting the clarity that you need at the moment and you, um, yeah, you're just feeling perhaps lost or unsure, uncertain um, and perhaps you've been struggling with this because steps do represent struggles. Now, the castle in the background can represent a home, so have there been struggles or, you know, uh, negativity within a home perhaps? Uh, whichever one relates to you, but they're wanting you to change your focus and especially to change your thoughts, okay, to more happy, uplifting thoughts. All right, let's continue with the next card. Best friends, true friends stick together no matter what. Okay, so have you had some issues with uh, your best friend, your bestie? Um, whether that is male or female, it doesn't matter. Um, what they're saying here to you is no matter what happens in your life, um, you know, good or bad, it's important to surround yourself with people who uplift you, you know, uplift you in a positive way and vice versa. So perhaps this is about you giving too much and not receiving. All right. But they're saying with this card that it's important that you surround yourself with like-minded people. Okay, and perhaps you've, you know, you've had a lot of support from a best friend lately, which is lovely as well. So, and your best friend doesn't have to be a human, it can be an animal as well. We see animals as best friends too, which is, um, which is important because animals come from a, you know, they come from unconditional love. And that's important in humans as well, that we do come from a place of unconditional love. And um, we, also would love to receive that from others too. Sometimes that's not possible. So again, surround yourself with people who are like-minded. All right, next card. Practice, practice, practice. With daily practice, you can polish your skills and talents and increase your confidence. Okay, so this can relate to these happy thoughts, practicing. Practicing affirmations. I've said this over and over again in so many readings lately. Affirmations are really um, uplifting, um, 
uplifting ways to you know create positivity within your life so for example I'm worthy I'm worthy of love and happiness I am safe I am love I am joy whatever it is that is going to give you that boost bring you that you know abundance into your life they're saying here that you need to form some sort of daily practice sorry about the background noise guys um, yeah daily practice so you get into a routine of um, living within the moment for example when you get out of bed um, and you step your feet onto the ground onto the floor um, say thank you practicing gratitude is another form of um, creating more of what you want in your life okay this can represent also within a job perhaps you need to you know um, polish on your skills within your job or this can be in order for you to make the move or that career advancement that you're wanting okay so yep practice and just like this um, fairy in this card could be practicing a new instrument music so whatever it is that you want it to relate to in your life that's what it is let's go to the next card new home moving is a step in the new direct in the right direction for you okay this card has come up a fair bit as well so for some of you this is actually what it, it is saying is you moving to a new home are you thinking about a move whether that is um, moving into state perhaps or you know changing cities um, definitely changing a home um, because it is in the cards for you there's a lot of protection around you with Archangel Michael who's surrounding you at the moment with this move they're saying that um, a move a shift some thing is in the works for you okay so maintain those happy thoughts perhaps you're gonna have this friend you know best friend who's gonna help you move um, this can also relate again to employment changing career perhaps altogether or just changing jobs but there is a shift and there's definitely a move that is coming for some of you out there who've been inquiring about this let's just uh, confirm it with the next card because these are the angel answers cards okay remain positive all right so yeah this is something that um, is definitely something you need to focus on is what they're saying is to remain positive look at that angel look how they're holding all those beautiful flowers this is abundance it's coming okay trust the process it is coming maintain those happy thoughts yes remain positive um, surround yourself with those people who are like-minded practice you know and this new home there is some sort of shift so they're saying that if you've lost hope or lost faith in a certain situation it's important for you to maintain that positive outlook because there is something you know positive and new that perhaps you can't yet see that is happening behind the scenes okay so it is positive and it is coming into your life it's just a matter of when and that is up to divine timing look at all that beautiful white light okay so it will happen I don't feel it that it's far definitely this year though just maintain your positive attitude all right the tarot cards leap of faith believe in yourself listen to your heart do what gives you joy yes how gorgeous is this and confirmation of this reading as well because this is about you making the next move okay practicing what it is that you want to achieve in your life maintaining those happy and positive thoughts but they're saying that the power is within you you need to believe in your abilities you need to believe in yourself okay because you are you're an amazing person you need to listen to your heart you need to listen to what your body your gut is telling you okay and what is it that brings you joy into your life this is a zero this is a new beginning for you because the card is a zero okay trust because that dog is all about trust and loyalty perhaps this is about you putting your faith in other people perhaps you've been stuck you haven't been able to trust fully this is about you taking that leap putting your faith and trust in someone whether it is your best friend um, whether it is you know a soulmate there is change and transformation coming because you're surrounded with butterflies here okay but you're very well protected so don't fear get out of your comfort zone okay and take that leap beautiful 
All right, next card. Nine of Ariel. Your dreams are fulfilled. Hard work leads to great success. A love for the beautiful things in life. Well, here's your confirmation. Once you do all this work, you know, you maintain those positive thoughts, there's a change coming, you take that leap of faith, you're gonna be rewarded. This is a beautiful, beautiful card to receive. Look at that rainbow. The rainbow is all about joy, pride. Everything is going to be okay. All right, all your hard work, all the positive affirmations, all the you know positive intentions that you're setting, everything that you've done will lead you to this moment. All right, and you will find a new love for things, um, whether that is within yourself, a career, a move of some sort, you know, a new love of life, um, a new love as in a life partner. It's all being worked out for you, okay? So just welcome it and keep riding those waves, okay? So just go with the flow. Next card, last card. Wow, it's the lovers. Make choices from your heart, deeply emotional commitments, the power of love, yes. So again, coming from your a place of love, as I mentioned earlier, with the happy thoughts, all this is all relating here for you. So this is, if you've been questioning about um, you know, your soulmate, this person, the lover's card is here for a reason. This is about you two reuniting, getting back together, making a move, who's gonna make the first move? This can be also a commitment, all right? A commitment of love. Look at that beautiful angel shining upon you. It's Archangel Raphael. He's the Archangel of healing. He's here to heal this love, to heal this beautiful relationship that you have. If you've had issues in your current relationship, there's healing that's coming, okay? And it's important for you to come from a place of love. Really tap into your emotions, be open and honest with this person and with yourself as well, okay? Because love is powerful. Um, and it's important that you have trust and have faith. This can be you taking the leap of faith within this situation and with this person, okay? But your, all your hard work is going to pay off and it is going to be rewarded. Just remain positive, maintain those happy thoughts about you, about this loved one, if that's what you're inquiring about with a relationship, could be about a job as well. So apply this to whichever area of your life that it, um, you know, it symbolizes or you can relate to. But I'd like to thank you all for tuning in. Um, again, if you're after your own personal reading, they are still only for $20 until the 31st of August, and then the price will go up. It is an email reading, so Angel Light Healing, L-Y-T-E. For those of you who have requested a reading, um, you will receive the reading either today or by tomorrow. For those of you who are watching who have sent me an email, um, I have had quite a large response to this and I'm very grateful for you all. Um, and again, if you're after your own personal reading, just get in contact with me. But I wish you all a wonderful Wednesday, many angel blessings, and I'll be back tomorrow with another reading for you. Take care and look after yourselves and happy thoughts, okay? Remain positive. It's all gonna work out. Thanks guys, bye.